Hello everyone, my name is Mahulan and welcome back to our channel. In today's video, I am in a coastal town called Victor Harbour which is situated nearly 80 kilometers south of Adelaide in South Australia. This town is a popular tourist spot in South Australia where you can experience good weather, good food and outstanding sceneries. There is also an island called Granite Island which is not far from this town and there are also host drone trams operating across the host way to reach and explore that island. So in today's video you guys are going to watch this beautiful town and the activities we can do here. Also I am going to take a host drone tram to Granite Island and we are going to do trekking around that island as well. If you guys are new to this channel or watching without subscribing, I would like to ask you guys to consider subscribing to our channel and hit the bell icon for future updates and without further delay, let's start our journey. First we are going to go to the information center in this town and let's end care about the activities we can do in this town. The place with the sign of letter I is the Visitor Information Center. Let's go and ask them what we can do today. Alright guys, I got a map and a little information from the Visitor Center. There are a lot of places and things to do in this small town. I'm going to stay here only for 4 hours and I reckon I can only cover a few activities here. In this map we are right here guys. This place is called as Grenade Island. In between these two places there is a causeway going. On that causeway the horse trams are being operated. We are definitely going on that horse tram and I will cover a few things before we leave from here. Let's go guys. The place we are standing is a bay. This bay is called as Encounter Bay guys. And when you go straight, you can go to Antarctica, the coldest continent in the world. As you see guys, at the far, you can see Granite Island. That's where we are going to go in the horse tram. Let's walk along the coast and go to the horse tram station. Along this beach, there is also a carnival happening guys. The kids here are enjoying this very much. As I said before, this coastal town is full of entertainment and a very nice place to spend your holidays with your family and friends. This is where you can take your horse tram. You can see some notice boards here guys. Welcome to the Victor Harbour Horse Drawn Tramway. As you see in the picture here, there will be a very big horse drawing the tram and that tram will travel on the tram tracks. You can see everything on this board. In the next notice board, the history of the horse drawn tram services are mentioned here. It is said that these tram services are started in 1864 and you can see the old causeway in the photo here. Our Clydesdales. Clydesdale is a Scottish breed of draught horse which is used to pull these trams. These horses weigh around 700 to 1000 kilograms and they can also grow up to the height of 1.8 meters. These horses are very strong and one horse can pull a single tram with 50 people sitting in that. Look at the size of these horses guys. Very massive and they are beautiful too. They have dense hair in their feathers, hooves and tails. They look very cute with their dense hair. On this board you can see the Clydesdale being used here. 
There are seven Clydesdale horses used to pull these trams and you can see their names on this board here. If you guys wish to contribute financially to these horses, you can contribute here. There is also a souvenir shop just near to this tram shop guys. You can buy anything in memory of visiting this beautiful coastal town. Tickets are available from the tram driver when the tram returns to the platform. So I reckon we need to get our tickets from the tram driver. One tram is returning from that Granite Island guys. That's coming in that direction. You guys can see the tram tracks here and that's the tram platform. We just need to go and wait there. You guys can see a tram coming from the Granite Island. These tram services start at 10.30 and every 45 minutes there is a tram service till 3.30 in the evening. Now I am at the top of this tram guys. We are going to the island behind me and let's enjoy this beautiful tram journey. I just love this tram journey guys. Look how slowly and steadily this horse is pulling us. On our way, just parallel to the new causeway, you guys can see the old causeway through which the tram services were operated in the early days. On our opposite, you guys can see the other tram coming back from the Granite Island and there are two tracks in this region for both trams to pass each other. Alright guys, we came to this Granite Island. As I heard from the locals here, we can watch penguins, whales and seals in this island. But to watch them all, we should be lucky. Anyway, let's go around this island and see what we can find here. In this rocky hill, there are wooden footpaths installed for people to access easily 
and while walking over this you guys can enjoy the view of this beautiful blue ocean which is surrounding this granite island. This is the South Australian Granite Island guys. Look at the beauty of this small island and the sea surrounding this. Just amazing. Look at this board guys, meaning in the rocks. I stood down there and looked around. I saw Jerinjeri Yundi and old Yaringeri man looking out to sea. He is looking out for the whales, seals and penguins. This is how an Aboriginal person looked at these rocks guys. This is a belief of Aboriginal people and that is mentioned here in this board. I can see some immature person try to tear this board. It's no good and the worst thing you can ever do. There is also some information about the southern right whales mentioned here. It is said that the southern right whales migrate to South Australia from Antarctica during the coldest period of the year and people can watch them roaming in the sea with their babies. We are now walking on the top surface of the granite island guys. There are a lot of granite rocks and nothing other than small shrubs and bushes on this island. This is the view from the top of this island guys. You can see the tram causeway on which we came to this island from here. This view is so beautiful from the top of this island guys. Alright guys, now let's walk down and go back to the South Australian mainland. This is the real entrance of Granite Island guys. I just noticed this one after I completed this trail only as we started walking through another entrance. You can see there are three beautiful small penguin statues which are cuddling each other here. On this side you guys can see a face of a man carved into this big rock. It looks natural and beautiful. Alright guys, now I am on my way back to the Australian mainland through this causeway. That's a wrap for this video and I hope you guys would have enjoyed this video. If you guys like this video, leave a thumbs up on this video. Please consider subscribing to our channel and hit the bell icon to watch videos like this every week. I will see you all in another amazing episode. Till then, thanks for watching and cheers.